This is the Holiday Inn Resort. This is where Natalie and her classmates were staying. This is the lobby area where Joran Vandersloot and Deepak and Satish Kalpo indicated that they had dropped Natalie off. Natalie was actually staying in the six-story building furthest from us, and on May 30th uh, is when she disappeared. 32 people with seven, eight chaperones arrived in Aruba, and uh, they were looked at the resort right on the beach, so it was a big party. That area right there was closed. This was the exit. Um, Natalie's room would have been closer to the front towards that side. Uh, I used to know it. I think it was 311 or 302. I can't remember now, but... Um, um, Did she have a roommate? She yeah, there were four in a room. They had double beds, uh, uh, four kids to a room, and, and I think about 128 kids came on the trip. So, Yarn would go to these hotels and blend in with the other kids, gain trust with some of these girls you know, kind of socialize in and, you know, when you're at a hotel with other people and you're out there out and about swimming and stuff with them, the guests have the idea that you're a guest as well. So, and it was rumored, uh, one of the classmates had indicated that Jorn Vandersloot told her that he was over here vacationing from Holland. He played soccer over there. And, I think some of them had recognized him from, you know, a few days prior, you know, coming in and out of the casino and uh, wandering around, you know, in the beach area. Back behind me is uh, the Excelsior Casino. That's where Natalie met uh, Jorn Vandersloot along with some of her other friends. The day before she went missing, Natalie and a bunch of classmates ran into Jorn where he was playing uh, blackjack poker along with his father. And uh, during that time, it's my understanding that uh, uh, her friend had lost quite a bit of money and Jorn volunteered to help her out, show her how to play the game and help her win some of her money back. Natalie was not gambling at all. She was just an observer. At some point in time during that card game, the girls had indicated that they were going to Carlos and Charlie's and invited Yorin to come out there with them. I found out about the class trip to Aruba about a day before the deadline was to be turned in. And uh, my immediate response was, no way. So I resisted. And then after a couple of months, went to the graduation. relented and told her to be careful, but uh, that was the last time I ever saw that. <laughs>